Hello and welcome to our video series on integration of digital material in teaching. In this video, we'll be focusing on Prezi and all its useful and interesting features. Prezi is an online presentation creation software that allows users to create compelling graphical presentations and videos. If you want to use Prezi, you need to create a Prezi account on the Prezi website and sign up with your email address. Let's log in together. Once you're in the dashboard, on the left side, you can see the toolbar. With all projects button, you can see all of your projects. On Prezi video button, you can create a video presentation. Click on Quick Record on your Prezi dashboard. Simply start by clicking the plus icon and add your text from the sidebar. You can drag or drop a visual from your computer to your slide or search it on a Prezi's image library, click on Add Visual. You can add from your computer, or you can add from cloud, or you can just search from here. If you want to add a new slide, just click on this plus. You can also add short clips in MP4 format to play while recording or presenting live. Just drag and drop your video here. Use the three dots on the slide's thumbnail to remove or replace the visual, edit the text or delete the slide. To rearrange your slides, simply click and drag them in the side panel. You can change your template anytime by going to the three dots on the top of the sidebar and selecting Choose Template. Once your content is ready, turn on your camera and you can now choose to record it or you can present it live. When you have done recording, click Done Recording. Now you can trim your video or just save your video. Let's go back to the main page. Prezi Design is a tool to create graphic design and data visualization. You can create interactive and engaging reports, infographics, social media posts and more. Click Start from Templates and choose from hundreds of templates. Then you choose your template. Click on Use this template icon. On the left side toolbar, you can add many things like text, chart, map, image, video, and so on. On the right side toolbar, you can adjust settings like size, background. Once you have done it, you can download your creation by clicking the download button. You can also share your project by clicking the share button and copying the link. Click the button on the left side toolbar and Save your project. Let's go to home page again. On Prezi Present section, you can create presentations. Click on Create from Template again. Choose a template you like. On the top of the middle screen, there are buttons used to edit the templates. The Style button is used to edit the templates, color, background, font, and many more. You can adjust the settings of the text with the text button. With the media button, you can add images, videos, audio, and etc. You can add shapes and lines with the shape button. On story block, you can add table, timeline, list, and so many things. With more button, you can make transitions and animation. You can also add presenter notes, but it is not free. With the topic button on the left side of the screen, you can add planet topic or stack topic. On the top right, you can click this icon and start your presentation. All of the things you have done is automatically saved. Let's go to home page again. You can see your own project and other uploaded projects with library button. Brand kit lets you pre-select your brand's colors, logos, and fonts, but it's not free. You can see and reload the projects you deleted with a trash button for 30 days. Now you know how to use Prezi. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions or feedback, please feel free to leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe for more video education content.